Okay, in this lesson I want to talk to you about uh, the kind of gear that I use. Um, a lot of people ask me about my sound and how I go about getting the sound that I get. Um, there's really not that much to it, uh, to be quite honest with you. Um, I've got a Blackstar HT5 Metal here which I'm using and um, I can take you through some of the settings. Uh, we've got uh, the uh, reverb level which I've got completely off because I don't need it for now. Um, the ISF which is basically their sort of like British American sweep. Um, I've got it leaning towards the right just for a bit more low end. Um, I've got the uh, the treble just over halfway, the mid just under halfway, and the bass is all the way up. Um, that's pretty much how I set most of my amps up. Um, if I you know plug into anything, but you know I'm sort of strictly using uh, Blackstar gear now, so this is pretty much what I'm uh, using. Uh, I just use the 100 watt version of this, um, like playing live or anything like that, but. Um, I'm just using this, and this is direct out straight into um, the computer, which we re we're uh, recording this lesson with. Um, the volume isn't up that high, but um, the, the main sole reason for that is so it doesn't pick up on the mic, so you can get a true representation of how the amp sounds. Um, and the overdrive, I mean, this thing's got quite a lot of gain, um, but I am using two pedals with it as well. I'm using uh, a Maxon 808, um, We've uh, taken pictures of it so you can you can see how it's set and what it looks like. And uh, there's a noise suppressor, which is a Boss NS2. Um, and there's uh, the settings have been taken a picture of as well, so you can see how that's been set up. So straight from my guitar into the tube screamer, into the noise gate, and then into the front end of the amp. And uh, that's pretty much it. I haven't got the overdrive set on the pedal at all. The overdrive's completely off, but the output is all the way up and the tone knob is completely down the middle. So, um, so yeah, let me just play a couple of riffs for you just so you can hear how this thing sounds and, uh, and I'll play a bit of sort of lead as well on the same channel. I might kind of change the EQ settings a little bit and maybe add some reverb in there as well just so you can hear how that sounds as well. So here's just some basic rhythm um, with the actual, all the pedals on and the amp. Okay, so you can get an idea of how it sounds. I mean, it comes out like really great as well. And the, uh, the DI on the back of this head has got a one by 12 cab selection or a four by 12 cab selection um, for the emulated out. I've got it set on the four by 12 setting. Uh, it just to me sounds a little bit wider and a little bit more like uh, just a bigger sound. If you want a kind of more focused, direct kind of sound, um, the one by 12 is, is pretty good for that as well. There's not a huge amount of difference between the two, but I just prefer uh, the 4x12 setting. Um, okay, right, so I'm just going to play a couple of licks um, lead wise for you so you can hear how this sounds. Um, the only thing I've done, I haven't changed any of the EQ, I've just added a bit more gain on the amp just for a bit more playability and I've added in some reverb as well just to give it a bit of uh, atmosphere. So let's see how that, see how that sounds. <laughs> 